Morning. Morning. We're on the road again. Yep, we are leaving Pichilinque Beach. We've been here for a, a little, little while. while. Yeah, yeah, quite some time. We'll talk about that in a little bit. But we're headed into La Paz. We're going to go find a campground that's uh, just, I guess, about a 20-minute walk from the Malacan. Yep. Because what time of the year is it? It is carnival time. It is carnival time. Looking yep. forward to our first experience with carnival. It's supposed to be awesome in La Paz. Awesome in La Paz. Yep. So we're going to go check that out. We're going to leave Pichalinga Beach and head into town, camp at Aquamarine RV Park, and mm -hmm. then hopefully have a spot. It is a busy time, of course, with Carnival going on. It's a busy time, but we're going to head into town and do that. We have arrived and we are all set up at Aquamarine RV Park right in, right in town in La Paz. We are just a short 15 minute walk to the Malacan where we're going to go do the Carnival, hopefully this afternoon. Here's our spot. It is a decent little RV park that is just in town. It is on the water, not on a pretty part of the water, but it is on the water, close to everything. Uh, have electric, have dump, there's showers, there's Wi-Fi. So good enough. It is 500 pesos, so it's a little more on the pricey side, but for being in town and close to everything, it's worth it. Getting a little work done beforehand. Hooray for Wi-Fi. Hooray for, yeah. Yep, we're back in, back in civilization. Lindsay, where are we headed? Carnival. <laughs> We've got a hotel room for one of the nights at Carnival, and we're gonna go out and hang out on the balcony and check out Carnival Parade from the balcony.
Some yep. Carnival 2020 in the books. If you ever, box. yeah, if you're ever in La Paz around the time of Carnival, do it. It's worth it. So much fun, and we are exhausted. I feel like I walked 10 miles today. I'm pretty sure we did. I feel like I ate four pounds of churros today. Yeah, you did. He went and got churros twice, twice, and I can't eat them because I'm on a gluten-free diet. But I'm not, so that's why I ate two of them. I wish you'd look at me in the way you looked at churros. I'm looking at you right now the way I look at churros. But you're not drooling. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to call it a night. We are exhausted. And it's kind of late. So.